How's it going guys, Sharblox here. This video is going to be all about the Zara Larsson concert experience. Originally, I wasn't going to make a video about this, but this topic is so interesting and funny, I thought I just had to, I can't miss this. I did actually make a video a couple of days ago about the Zara Larsson event prizes, but all I did in that video was collect the free event prizes off the avatar shop. I didn't actually get a chance to play the event itself, simply because for that video, I didn't need to. The prizes are free in the event as well, they do do come with a badge so if you guys want to get that go ahead and play the event but you can also take them off the avatar shop in seconds so yeah that's a lot easier now apparently there was some drama about this event a few days ago that involved me green lego cats and kaneko kitten i'm only going to talk about this briefly but us three youtubers were getting blamed because the event had a lot of dislikes the funny thing is i don't think any of us have even reviewed this event yet but people still went over to twitter to complain and it was all our fault that people were disliking the event maybe the reason we got blamed is because sometimes we laugh at strange roblox events maybe we laugh at afro characters that sort of thing we also state our own opinions quite a lot which is fair enough if you don't share the same opinions as us it's also very common for roblox games to receive dislikes that's just how roblox works anyway the topic of this video is going to be about the zara larson event because something really funny happened in the event's live show basically zara herself was able to type in the roblox chat and this would be broadcasted across every roblox game so she couldn't really interact with fans like if you were typing in the chat as the same time as her you couldn't really have a conversation with her but she could type out random sentences and post them in the chat basically for you guys to read but there is one thing to keep in mind for zara's roblox chat settings there was no slow mode or cooldown time she could basically send messages as fast as she wanted to and there was also no filter which means she could say anything she wanted to without getting tagged and this includes swear words some of you can see where this video is going Basically guys, she said the F word on a Roblox game without getting tagged into loads of fans. Now, I just want to make this clear. I'm not trying to expose Zara or saying she is bad or anything stupid like that. Honestly, I thought this was really funny and really good publicity for the event as well. And now literally everyone is talking about it. The thing is, everyone makes mistakes. This was a pretty funny mistake, not gonna lie. And this is what she said. So this was pretty much the first swear word. She said, I oofing love rhubarbs. Now, I'm not going to say it in this video. Obviously, Sharkblocks is a family-friendly channel. But yeah, the fact she said this on a Roblox game is just hilarious to me. She also said after it, swear I'm the real Zara Larson. Yeah, you literally did just swear. That's kind of jokes. But yeah, guys, it didn't quite stop there. Shout out to these guys for the tweets as well. So many of you guys were tweeting me about this. She also said, there we go. And then she straight up said the F word. So just like, oof. Yeah, twice is quite funny, not gonna lie. I'm surprised someone didn't tell her to be honest but that's hilarious but i don't blame her whatsoever she clearly didn't know shout out to whoever owns these screenshots i don't know i just saw them on discord so after she said the f word she also said they censored me too now it was good while it lasted and she did also apologize sorry for swearing earlier haha i didn't think it would get through so maybe she was just typing out the f word she was just posting it in the chat maybe she didn't think it would go through maybe she was a little bit confused about how the roblox chat works but honestly i think she's a really chill person um her and Lil Nas X were probably the most involved with the Roblox community. Why don't we? And the other artist that I forgot about. God, what was her name? See, she clearly wasn't very good because I completely forgot about her. Oh, Ava Max. That was it. It was Ava Max, wasn't it? And the other one as well. What was the other one called? It was Royal Blood. I just remembered their name. So yeah, Royal Blood, Ava Max, why don't we? They did not get involved with the Roblox community whatsoever, which is why pretty much everyone forgot about them. But Zara Larson and Lil Nas X, we're going to remember them because they did some crazy stuff and that's actually kind of funny wait hang on a second why did me green lego cats and kaneko kitten get called out it's not even got as much dislikes as i originally thought oh well i guess people like to complain anyway we're going to play the zara larson launch party event maybe i will give my review the live party did actually finish already i managed to record a little bit but it finished kind of quick i was a bit late to it it doesn't really matter let's just play the game and see what it's like so here we are on the event i'm just going to look at this briefly it looks 
like we've got a lake, we have got a merch stall, we have got a concert arena, and we also have a learn. I think the learn thing is like a quiz, you can get a badge, you can get the prizes. Like I said, the free prizes are already on the catalog, so you don't really have to do any of this stuff. The next live concert is in 19 hours, just like this girl said, so you do have to wait like a little bit of time. The last one was only a couple of hours ago, and that is when she was swearing. Okay, so my honest opinion on this event, what do I think about it? Um, Visually, it looks very good. We've got like the castle, we've got like the merch stores, everything looks quite nice. The reason why I wouldn't necessarily play this is because I just don't really like this type of music. What would you call this type of music? Just kind of like generic sort of pop music, you know, stuff you get on the radio all the time. Yeah, I definitely wouldn't listen to that. I noticed it's got like um, Swedish and British flags. Is she like half Swedish, half British? I think she must be. But the thing is, she has an American accent. So yeah, that's kind of interesting. I honestly don't know. Talking about Sweden though, if this was like a Young Lean concert or a Blade concert or a Young Sherman concert, I'd love it. I would think this is cool. I'm just not really into Zara Larsson pop music. But no, apart from that, like the event visually, it looks pretty good. Like there's some quests. You can collect water bottles. So there you go. You found Zara's water bottle. Oh, she probably needs that back. Don't want to get like dehydrated or anything like that. I guess those people on Twitter expected me, Green Lego Cats and Kaneko Ketten to be like, oh my God, Zara Larsson. I love her music. Oh, she's so cool. Yeah, but we all have our own music taste. So we just wouldn't really listen to this sort of thing, I guess. But there you go. <laughs> Look at this. Everyone's just talking about her swearing. Um, but yeah, guys, this is the concert hall. See, I'm just as famous as Zara Larson because I've got two bodyguards here. So that's pretty cool. No, but what was I saying, guys? This is the concert hall. So when the event starts, this is where you go. You can see the performance. Her and her backing dancers are like dancing on the TV, you know, performing that sort of thing. It's a really good event. Well made. It's just not for everyone because not everyone likes pop music. And there we have it, guys. Everything that happened in the Roblox Zara Larson concert experience, concert event, concert game. I don't know, whatever it's called. The main reason why I wanted to make this video obviously was because of the swearing. That was really funny, to be honest. And there we go. So if you guys enjoyed this video, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Let me know your own opinion about this concert down below in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.